Welcome to another quick guide and this one is on how to beat Alexander the Summon in Corel and then we will show you where to get its divine intel to have it at max level in Final Fantasy Rebirth. I'm Sifon Yiga and this is only boss fights and let's dive right in. This time we are going to show you how to beat Alexander first. Alexander is a mechanical giant and with most machines its weakness is electricity. I like using Cloud's Plasma Discharge skill that you get from completed simulations and having the enemy ability material equipped to do a good amount of damage to him. Secondly, you want to have someone in your party equipped with a level 2 cleansing material because certain attacks will build up karma on the party and depending on the level of karma is how much damage is done when Alexander does the Divine Judgment attack to each character. Using Isuna on your party removes the karma side effect, that's why you need the level 2 cleansing material. First you'll have to cripple both arms to pressure Alexander. I recommend staying in Cloud's operator stance and stay as much in the air as you can. This avoids his moves like Earth Tremor and Wave Cannon. Once pressured, hit the main body with as many special attacks and lightning base attacks to fill up its stagger meter as much as you can. Alexander might teleport to the other side of the arena to avoid your attacks and regenerate its arms. He will have more attacks but staying in the air will avoid these. Yeah. <laughs> 
Take the lead. Once you get him staggered, unleash hell onto him, and you can get him down with just the one stagger. Staggering Alexander can also interrupt the Divine Judgment attack. And that is how you get the Alexander Materia. Now we are going to show you where to get the Divine Intel that levels up the summon and gives you the easier difficulties to defeat him as I did. To find all the divine intels in the Kurau region, you will need to be past the Golden Saucer and through the Dust Bowl to the Kurau Desert. First divine intel will show on your map after activating the second Remna Wave Tower by the Kurau Beach. This will be west of the gym by a cliff face with some water. Here you can find a crystal to smash that will reveal a tunnel in the cliff face and lead you to Alexandra's Sanctuary Alpha. Do the mini game and collect the first divine intel. The second divine intel will show on your map after activating the fourth remnant wave tower in the Corel Desert. The next entry is southwest of the tower. Head through the valley to the desert and you will see a smashable crystal. Follow this till you get to some construction equipment and grapple up to the ledge. And then grapple two more times up and land in the cave. Here is Alexander Sanctuary, bravo. Do the mini game and get Divine Intel 2. The final Divine Intel is near where the story continues after you get control of the buggy at the Coral Desert Waypoint. Head northwest with the buggy and you will find some water. Head across this water and then on the right you will see a smashable crystal. This will show you to a ledge where you will have to grapple three times and then climb onto a wall. And then you follow it left to Alexander's Sanctuary Gamma. Do the mini game and you will get Divine Intel free. And that is how you get the highest leveled Alexander Summon. <laughs>